I believe that uh, we are all responsible to the same taxpayer, whether it be the uh, $89 million that uh, the Senate costs the taxpayers or the one point some billion dollars that the taxpayers put out for CBC. Lately there has been a lot of attention. Public outrage is the words that Peter Mansbridge used on Senate travel. And we found out only in the last few days that you had claimed close to $30,000 worth of ineligible expenses. You suggested these were not uh, related to living or travel. The expenses that were discussed were expenses related to living. The expenses that are the object of the reimbursement are expenses related to my expenses in Ottawa. Yes, Living uh, expenses. Yes, I suppose. Well, I don't want to have a, a conversation about what a living expense is, what I told you this evening, and what I told Rosemary Barton, and what we posted is we found a mistake. We, as soon as we found the mistake, sir, I paid back those expenses. I immediately advised my board. We informed the Auditor General of Canada. We informed the Government of Canada. We apologize, and that's where we are today. You say you paid them back immediately upon finding out that yes, uh, you had done this, and yet um, found out the mistake in June, and you only paid it back in September. Why would you not have paid it back in June if you found out the mistake? In as soon as we totaled the numbers, sir, as soon as we went through every single voucher, and it was done not only by ourselves, but it was done by an independent third party, Deloitte, that went through every single expense. As soon as they totaled that amount, within 48 hours, check was made, I repaid. You repaid in September, and we found out about it through Sun Media in February. Would you, why, would you not have considered doing some kind of a release in September, letting the people know that you had done this? I think the taxpayers in Canada uh, have the right to know. Your radio, your, your, your broadcast, Peter Mann, the, the outrage, he, he continues uses the word public outrage over Senate expenses, us traveling business class, us possibly mis, mis, uh, misreporting or uh, not reporting some, Senator, some, Senator some statements. Plett, Senator Plett, I would just like your questions to be focused more on the CBC. Forget about the Senate issue. Well, I think, Chair, it, it, if I want to do a comparison, find out why CBC is doing one thing, why they aren't doing the other thing for the President. So I really clearly think it is related. They have done one thing to parts of the public, and they are not reporting the same thing there. Do you not think, sir, that the public would be just as outraged about your misappropriating expenses as anybody else? Senator Plett, at the risk of repeating myself and telling you what, in my opening remarks, I said, what we've posted online, the, the, the work that, is, that has been done to be extremely clear and transparent about what happened, it was a mistake. We found out, or I found out, through a, an HR person that was looking at something else and said, whoops, we have a problem. As soon as we saw that problem, told my chair, told my HR committee chair, told the whole board, we went back, told the Auditor General, told the government, documented everything, made sure that the amount of money, it was not like these expenses, Senator Plett, were, were hidden. They had been on our website and posted because the way that we do this, Senator, my expenses are filed. Somebody, a director of finance, looks at them, makes sure that they are in line with what's been done. Then the chair of our, our board approves them. They're audited on a court. They're posted on our website. And all these 29,000 have been there since June of 2008, or January of 2008 when I came in. As soon as we saw the issue, I repaid these dollars. We advised everybody. We disclosed. And again, today I'm apologizing because these kinds of mistakes go to the integrity of what we do every day, and that doesn't work with me.